Picture this. You get on a plane in New York City. Two hours later, you arrive in Tokyo. This is the potential of hypersonic travel, and the United States could be close to achieving it. We're talking about speeds exceeding Mach 5, or five times the speed of sound. That's fast enough to traverse continents in just a few hours. This isn't mere science fiction. It's a new era in aviation history. The quest for hypersonic speed is a tale of ambition, innovation, and fierce global competition. It's a narrative that has been evolving for decades. Now, we are on the brink of a major breakthrough. Humanity has always been fascinated by speed. From the dawn of aviation, engineers and pilots have relentlessly pushed the limits, aiming to fly faster and higher. Breaking the sound barrier was just the start. As technology evolved, so did our aspirations. The next milestone was hypersonic flight, where speeds exceed five times the speed of sound. The Cold War era brought a new urgency to the quest for hypersonic flight. The intense rivalry between the United States and the Soviet Union fueled a race for technological dominance. Both nations knew that mastering hypersonic capabilities could shift the balance of power. The US and the Soviet Union were engaged in a technological arms race. It wasn't just about building the fastest aircraft, it was about showcasing military and technological superiority on a global scale. Hypersonic technology promised not only faster aircraft, but also advanced missiles capable of evading defenses and striking with unmatched speed and precision. Hypersonic aircraft and missiles were seen as the key to military dominance. The ability to deploy weapons at hypersonic speeds would revolutionize warfare, enabling strikes anywhere in the world within minutes. This potential made hypersonic research a top priority for military strategists and engineers. Early hypersonic experiments were cloaked in secrecy. Governments invested heavily in research and development, often in hidden facilities. Scientists and engineers worked under strict confidentiality, with their projects classified at the highest levels. Despite the secrecy, the progress was groundbreaking. Researchers focused on rocket-powered vehicles that could briefly reach hypersonic speeds. These early tests were crucial for understanding the challenges and possibilities of hypersonic flight. Rocket engines provided the necessary thrust, but sustaining hypersonic speeds required overcoming numerous technical obstacles. These early efforts faced many challenges. Numerous test flights ended in failure, with vehicles crashing or disintegrating under extreme conditions. Engineers had to constantly troubleshoot and innovate, learning from each setback and gradually improving their designs. The extreme heat and pressure at hypersonic speeds pushed materials and designs to their limits. Traditional materials couldn't withstand these conditions, leading to the development of new, advanced materials capable of enduring high temperatures and stresses. Despite the difficulties, early pioneers laid the foundation for future advancements. Their relentless pursuit of knowledge and innovation paved the way for breakthroughs. Each experiment, successful or not, provided valuable data that brought us closer to sustained hypersonic flight. They envisioned a future where hypersonic flight was not just possible, but commonplace. Their vision extended beyond military uses, imagining a world where commercial hypersonic travel could shrink the globe, enabling travel between continents in mere hours. Their efforts sparked ongoing innovation. Modern engineers and scientists build on the foundation laid by these early pioneers, pushing the boundaries of what is possible and bringing us closer to a future where hypersonic flight is a reality for all. The X-15 stands as one of the most iconic symbols of early hypersonic ambition. This aircraft was a marvel of engineering, showcasing human ingenuity and determination. Developed in the 1950s, the X-15 wasn't just about breaking the sound barrier. It represented a bold leap into the unknown, pushing the boundaries of aviation. The X-15 ventured into the realm of hypersonic flight, where speeds exceed five times the speed of sound. It was designed to explore these extreme conditions and gather invaluable data. Powered by a rocket engine, the X-15 set numerous speed and altitude records for manned aircraft. Its powerful engine allowed it to reach the edge of space, providing insights into high-speed aerodynamics and the challenges of re-entry. On October 3, 1967, William J. Knight piloted the X-15A2 to a staggering speed of Mach 6.7, or 4,520 miles per hour. This achievement was a milestone in aviation history, showcasing the incredible capabilities of the X-15. 
This was the fastest any human had ever flown in an aircraft. The X-15's record-breaking flights provided a wealth of data that would inform future aerospace endeavors, including the development of the Space Shuttle. Despite its achievements, the X-15 had limitations. Its design and technology, while groundbreaking, were not without challenges. Its reliance on rocket fuel meant that flights were short, lasting only minutes. The intense speeds and altitudes also posed significant risks to the pilots and required meticulous planning and execution. The X-15 offered a glimpse into the potential of hypersonic flight, but it wasn't a practical solution for sustained travel. However, its legacy lives on, inspiring new generations of engineers and scientists to continue exploring the frontiers of flight. The data and experience gained from the X-15 program laid the groundwork for future advancements in both military and civilian aerospace technology, paving the way for the next era of high-speed travel. While the X-15 used rocket propulsion, another engine type was under investigation, the scramjet. Conventional jet engines compress air using rotating blades. Scramjets, on the other hand, have no moving parts. They rely on their high velocity to compress air into the combustion chamber. Imagine running and scooping water into your mouth at full speed. That's essentially how a scramjet works, but with air instead of water. The air is then mixed with fuel and ignited to produce thrust. This air-breathing mechanism provides a significant edge over rocket engines. Scramjets could maintain hypersonic speeds for extended durations. However, designing and operating scramjets is extremely challenging. They demand precise airflow control at very high velocities. Section 5. Introducing the Chimera, a new breed of engine. Hermes is a leading company in the development of scramjet technology. Their groundbreaking creation is the Chimera engine. This innovative design redefines the limits of air-breathing propulsion. The Chimera's uniqueness lies in its seamless transition between different operational modes. At lower speeds, it functions like a conventional jet engine. As the aircraft gains speed, it transitions smoothly to ramjet mode. Ultimately, it engages scramjet mode at hypersonic velocities. This adaptability provides the Chimera with a substantial edge. It enables aircraft to take off and land in a conventional manner, unlike rocket-powered systems. The aircraft then accelerates effortlessly to hypersonic speeds, delivering unprecedented flexibility and efficiency in hypersonic travel. Section 6. From Quarter Horse to Hypersonic Flight Hermes's path to hypersonic flight has been defined by a series of progressively ambitious projects. One of their initial achievements was the Quarter Horse, an unmanned aircraft built to test and enhance scramjet technology. Although the Quarter Horse didn't achieve hypersonic speeds, it provided crucial data on scramjet aerodynamics and performance. This success enabled Hermes to develop larger, more powerful vehicles. Each new model brought them closer to their ultimate objective. Currently, Hermes is working on a new generation of hypersonic aircraft, cloaked in secrecy. While details are limited, rumors indicate these vehicles could reach speeds beyond Mach 10. If accurate, this would signify a monumental advancement in aviation technology. Section 7. A World Transformed Hypersonic Possibilities The reach of hypersonic technology goes far beyond just reducing travel times. The military views hypersonic missiles and aircraft as revolutionary tools in modern warfare. Their incredible speed and agility could make traditional defense systems ineffective. Yet, the advantages of hypersonic technology extend beyond military use. Envision cargo planes transporting goods across continents in mere hours, transforming global trade, or hypersonic passenger jets making international travel quicker and more accessible than ever. However, with great power comes great responsibility. The rise of hypersonic technology brings numerous ethical and geopolitical challenges, the risk of an arms race, and the necessity for global cooperation to prevent misuse are critical issues. Section 8. The Future at Our Doorstep The horizon of hypersonic technology is filled with endless possibilities. Envision a world where vast distances are traversed in mere hours. This isn't just a fantasy. 
It's a vision swiftly turning into reality. It's a domain where science fiction meets reality, where the unthinkable becomes achievable. Engineers and scientists are redefining the limits of what we believed was possible, transforming theoretical ideas into real-world innovations. It's a tribute to the limitless creativity of the human spirit. Each blueprint, each prototype, and each test flight brings us closer to a future where hypersonic travel is the norm. The pursuit of speed is deeply embedded in our nature. From the Wright brothers' inaugural flight to the supersonic jets of the 20th century, humanity has always aimed to go faster and reach further. This drive has propelled us forward through history. Each aviation milestone has brought us closer to the stars, and now, hypersonic technology represents the next monumental leap. Hypersonic technology is the new frontier in this relentless quest. It promises to revolutionize not only travel, but also military capabilities and global logistics. It has the potential to reshape our world in significant ways, for better or worse. The implications of hypersonic technology go beyond speed. They impact security, the economy, and even our daily lives. The journey of hypersonic flight is just beginning. We stand at the dawn of a new era, where the sky is no longer the limit, but merely the starting point. Stay tuned, because the next chapter promises to be even more thrilling. The advancements we are witnessing today are just the beginning. We are on the brink of a new era, an era where the sky is no longer the limit, but merely the starting point. The future is at our doorstep, and it's more thrilling than we could have ever imagined.